Et pour compléter ce duo, veuillez réserver un accueil chaleureux à Marc. Shit's up, man. Yeah. That's it. That's it, dog. <laughs> I, I always wanted to be Benetrix this time. Oh, yes. oh. Yeah, yes. that would be fun. Yeah. Okay. Is, um, I guess, walking on to the set that first time, having traveled from New York and then coming to Leeds in London and then seeing New York there was so, it was very, very surreal. They had built all the, all the streets and um, you could like walk around and get lost in the streets really and um, they built like, a, like, I don't know, 10, 15 blocks and then eventually out of that imprint they also built um, Paris, which is so cool. And I, I used to love walking around the sets during my lunch break. And then for the second movie, which was really cool, there was like a meridian. And I'd stand there and eat my lunch. And I'd look one way and I'd be in New York. And then I'd look another way and I'd be in Paris. You know, and I thought that was really cool. I felt like I was time traveling or something. Or, I don't know. Going very quickly into, you know, teleporting. That's what I felt like. Uh, yeah, that was my favorite memory. And also working with all of these wonderful, delightful people. That's the first time I met Maz. And he was doing this, like, Buster Keaton thing on that show where there was this little hint of comedy that I noticed when, like, he'd open his refrigerator and there'd be all the meat there and he'd just have his face there, like, mm -hmm. And I, I talked to him about that. I was like, you're, you're, you're funny. And he's like, yes, I am. And uh, so we, we kind of hit it off like that in between takes. So that when I learned that he was coming to be Grindelwald, I was very pleased. I was like, that is a brilliant you know, casting choice. Very sad to see Johnny go. But uh, you know, if you're going to cast somebody as Grindelwald, Maz is pretty brilliant. Yeah, it's great to see him again. Who's, who, who, there you are. Hey, hello. The, uh, ah, the, uh, the hardest scene, I think physically, was uh, running from the erumpent. Because it was, I loved it. I love all the physical stuff. Um, but I had the armor on and the helmet. And it was like really hard to, to move with that. And uh, it was like in this like ice area, this frozen over pond area, so it was like freezing. It was wet. And I was just like, this is insane. But I, I love all that stuff. And, uh, and then like getting in the, uh, climbing up that tree with the rump in his underneath and I'm hanging upside down. Um, and I, and any, anytime you had a harness on, you know, and it, it's, it's, it pinches. I don't like it. A lot of pinching. A lot of pinching. A lot of pinching, right guys? Am I right? A lot of pinching? Alright. Thank you.